today I'm playing Mass Effect. I've only... I have looked into it, like, just for a couple of hours, uh, but that's about it. So, not much else. Um, but it's been, like, a few months since I checked it out last time. So it's been, it's been a while, like, half a year, maybe, so... Welcome Still. to Alliance Military Database. Ooh. Classified information requested. What? Establishing secure connection. Secure connection confirmed. Well. Please log in to access your profile. I guess that we call John. Profile reconstruction complete. Okay. I'll still call him John. Accept. Once you confirm your character uh, is complete, you will be unable to change any settings. It's okay. Identification confirmed. What would I regret? Yul? No. Just kidding. <laughs> okay. Okay, let's look at this. Combat difficulty. I would like it to be. I would like to check. I think normal is okay, not casual. Auto level up. Squad only. Oh, I, can't, I guess target assist off. That's good. Squad only. What? So it's a bit hard to sort of choose. Target assist. I don't want target assist. No, low. Can I just turn it off? I want it off. Okay. Low, I guess. Power usage. Subtitles. Yes, auto save. Yes. Let's do this thing. Yes. Well, what about Shepard? Earthborn, but no record of his family. Doesn't have one. He was raised on the streets. Learned to look out for himself. Um, he saw his whole unit die on a cruise. He could have some serious emotional scars. Every soldier has scars. Shepard's a survivor. I remember Is that his voice the kind of person we want protecting the galaxy? <laughs> That's the only kind of person who can protect the galaxy. I'll make the call. He has to have scars, goddammit, to protect the galaxy, don't you know? Oh. Explorers discovered a remains of animation spare for uh, decades to follow. These mysterious artifacts reveal startling new technologies enabling travel to the further the stars. The basis uh, for this incredible technology was forced that control the very fabric of space and time. Ooh. Yeah, that text was like blah 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 blah. blah. <laughs> if you're if you're a tiny bit slower than average, it's like it's gonna be like the Arcturus Prime relays in range, initiating transmission sequence. Commander. We are connected. Calculating transit mass and destination. The relay is hot, acquiring approach vector. All stations secure for transit. Check. Navigation. Check. Internal emission sync engaged. All systems online. Drift. Just under 1500k. 
Fifteen hundred is good. Your captain will be pleased. Ooh, I like I hate him. that guy. <laughs> Nihilus gave you a compliment, so you hate him. You remember to zip up your jumpsuit on the way out of the bathroom? That's good. I just jumped us halfway across the galaxy and hit a target the size of a pinhead. So that's incredible. Besides, specters are trouble. I don't like having them on board. Call me wow, paranoid. Wow, that's racist. Be paranoid. The council helped fund this project. They have a right to send someone to keep an eye on their investment. <clears throat> yeah, that is the official story. But only an idiot believes the official story. Mm. You always expect the worst. Well, bad feelings are an occupational hazard. But we don't go anywhere unless there's a good reason, so... What are we doing here? Joker! Status report. Just cleared the mass relay, Captain. Stealth system's engaged. Everything looks solid. Good. Find a comm buoy and link us into the network. I want mission reports relayed back to Alliance Brass before we reach Eden Prime. Okay, so this is the future, I and they're still, they're still Better wearing caps. Yourself, sir. I think Nihilus is headed your way. He's already here, Lieutenant. Tell Commander Shepard to meet me in the calm room for a debriefing. You get that, Commander? Hmm. I heard. I'm on my way. <laughs> Is it me or does the captain always sound a little pissed off? Only when he's talking to you, Joker. <gasps> Lol! Only when he's talking to you, Joker. That's a hint, Joker. Gotta shape up. Ooh, there's the names of everybody. What's your name? Oh, you can tell he's not important. He's like, what? What do you want with me? You, I just saw you. This looks so chill. These seats good. down here. They kind of look like the they're right leaning right back, but it's like the... Hey, bitch! How you doing? Wait. Navigator Presley. I don't think I'm going here. I think I need to go further. It's not the kind of place Spectre's visit. There's something Nihilus isn't telling us about this mission. That's Ooh. crazy. The captain's in charge here. He wouldn't Good take orders from the Spectre. Not his choice, Doc. Spectres don't answer to anyone. They can do whatever. Is this correct? How do I talk? No, that's. I'm not gonna shoot him. Hey, Commander <laughs> Shepard. I was hoping you'd get here first. It will give us a chance to talk. Sitting in the car. What are you doing in your car? Are you going somewhere? The captain said he'd meet me here. He's on his way. I'm interested in this world we're going to. Eden Prime. I've heard it's quite beautiful. Hmm. I've never been there. But you know of it. It's become something of a symbol for your people, hasn't it? Proof I'm that humanity really can not only establish I colonies slept. across the galaxy, but also protect them. But how safe is it, really? I slept really well uh, last night, so... I'm awesome. Hmm. This guy's definitely gonna betray us at some point. So where are you going? Since you're in your car. I'm very, like, curious. Are you going somewhere? <laughs> Uh, let's see. Proof that humanity can only establish colonies across the galaxy, but also protect them. But how safe is it, really? Mm. What's your point? If you've got something to say, just say it. Ooh. Your people are still newcomers, Shepard. The galaxy can be a very dangerous place. Oh, nice. Is the Alliance truly ready for this? Nice to get out a bit. Go into I the store. I think it's about time we told the commander what's really going on. This mission is far more than a simple shakedown run. So you're gonna shop for just like, uh, just stuff? Or are you gonna shop, uh, are you shopping something like specific that you need? The mission is far more than a simple shakedown run. Well, what's going on? Is someone gonna fill me in, Captain? We're making a covert pickup on Eden Prime. That's why we needed the stealth systems operational. Covert pickup. Why the secrecy? Wait, you should have told me. Yeah, you definitely should have like told me. I don't like being kept in the dark, Captain. This comes down from the top, Commander. Information strictly on a need-to-know basis. Mm -hmm. A research team on Eden Prime unearthed some kind of beacon during an excavation. It was Prothean. Food and Nintendo Switch. Oh my god, yes! I want a Nintendo Switch too, but I don't have the money. <laughs> Lol. 
but food. That's good. I hope you, uh, I hope you're gonna eat something nice today. What else can you tell me? This is Big Shepard. The last time humanity made a discovery like this, it jumped our technology forward 200 years. But Eden Prime <laughs> doesn't good. have the facilities okay. to handle something like this. We need to bring I'll the be on for back to the Citadel for three more stuff. hours, so... Obviously, this no goes worries. beyond mere human interests, Commander. This discovery could affect every species in Council space. Hmm. I love that I can choose my dialogue options. Uh, the discovery could affect... <sighs> I need to be... Dip I need to start being diplomatic. Um, so I'm gonna say I'm glad you're here. It never hurts to have a few extra hands on board. The beacon is not the only reason I'm here, Shepard. Nihilus wants to see you in action, Commander. He's here to evaluate you. Oh. Hmm. Guess that explains why I bump into him every time I turn around. The Alliance has been pushing for this for a long <laughs> time. Humanity wants a larger role in shaping interstellar policy. We want more say with the Citadel Council. The Spectres represent the Council's power and authority. If they accept a human into their ranks, it shows how far the Alliance has come. Not many could have survived what you went through on a cruise. You showed a remarkable will to live, a particularly useful talent. That's why I put your name forward as a candidate for the Spectres. What? Why would a Turian want a human in the Spectres? Not all Turians resent humanity. Some of us see the potential of your species. We see what you have to offer to the rest of the galaxy and to the Spectres. I call bullshit. We are an no. elite group. It's rare to find an individual with the skills we I see. I think he's trying to cement trust in I don't care me. that you're human, Shepard. I only care that you can do the job. I think I think he tries to cement some sort of trust in me. Uh, since he is... Uh, I, I don't think you can trust him. I think he's gonna betray us. Hmm. I assume this is good for the Alliance. Earth needs this, Shepard. We're counting on you. All right. I need to see your skills for myself, Commander. Eden Prime will be the first of several missions together. You'll be in charge of the ground team. Secure the beacon and get it onto the ship ASAP. Nihilus will accompany you to observe the mission. Okay. Investigate? No. Just give the word, Captain. We should be getting close to Eden. Captain, we got a problem. What's wrong, Joker? Transmission from Eden Prime, sir. You better see this. Bring it up on screen. It's a war zone down there. Get down. We are under attack, taking heavy casualties. I repeat, heavy casualties. We can't get e back. They came out of nowhere. We need. out after that no calm traffic at all just goes dead there's nothing reverse and hold of 38.5 status report 17 minutes out captain no other alliance ships in the area hmm. take us in joker fast and quiet this mission just got a lot more complicated a small strike team can move quickly without drawing attention it's our best chance to secure the beacon. Grab your gear and meet us in the cargo hold. Tell Alenko and Jenkins to suit up, Commander. You're going in. Hmm. Engaging stealth systems. Somebody was doing some serious digging here, Captain. Your team's the muscle in this operation, Commander. Go in heavy and head straight for the dig site. What about survivors, Captain? Helping survivors is a secondary objective. The beacon's your top priority. Approaching drop point one. Okay, Nihilus, you coming with us? I move faster on my own. Nihilus will scout out ahead. Mm. He'll feed you status reports throughout the mission. Otherwise, I want radio silence. 
I don't like putting my life in the hands of a Turian, sir. Nihilus is on our side. He wants you in this place, and he wants that beacon. Ready and able, sir. The mission's yours now, Shepard. Good luck! But, um... So, him we moving are ahead... Drop point two. I don't know. I don't know. I'm not too comfortable with, uh... Him on the team, actually. Like, I'm thinking... He wants to run alone. I think he's gonna do some shady shit. <laughs> this place got hit hard, Commander. <sighs> Hostiles everywhere. Your guard up. What's this? What the hell are those? What the hell? What are those? Don't worry, they're harmless. They're harmless? Yeah. Okay. I think I say so. Let's go past them then. I guess. Stay there. What happened here? Oh. Corpses. Um, what's going on? Game is awful. No. Plus shields. Press U to open the squad screen and improve real squad's abilities. What? Do I improve all of them? Or that's what I don't know. Well, do I just have these two? Did one of them die? Oh, wait. Okay. Throw. Okay. Paragon and Renegade. I can tell I'm gonna spend some time figuring this shit out. Yeah, I'm go I'm going to level up but not just yet. Clear. What just happened? Can we revive people? Sometimes Marines die. The rest of us just have to carry on. We still have to find that beacon. Lol. So one of the one, aye, of, the, aye, one of the alternatives was let's bury up. What? Let's bury our. Uh, what? Well, uh, we can't bury someone right in in the middle of a mission. And I think like yeah, that's something you take care of later. Lol. Damage protection. I would like that. Can I do that? Shield boost. Yes, please. Oh, I have more points. Assault rifle. That's overkill. I don't know how this works. Pistols? What? I don't know what this is. Charm? Yes. Intimidate. No, I would like some charm. Can I not do that? Yes, I could. Okay. Yay. Wow, I can undo them at any time. Okay, that's, uh, that's a very forgiving uh, skill system. The ability to, to undo any sort of Oh yeah, that's sprinting. Woo! Where's that coming from? Oh, over there. Oh. I've got some burned out buildings here. Yes. A lot of bodies. Sweet. So it's not I'm holding. Check it out. It's not I'm holding. To shit. The dig site. Toxic seals. What? What? What did they do? Hardened weave. Toxic seals. I wanna. Okay, we're gonna take it all. I have no idea what they do. Hey, we need to help you. No. Wait. 
I need to do something with Caden too. Oh wait, I spent all points on John. <laughs> I didn't mean to, no! <laughs> but uh, I can take those back. Let's undo. Oh, I can't do that now because I went, yeah, because I went out of the menu. Okay, next points are yours, Caden. Sorry about it. <laughs> Seems like aiming is too easy. I don't know. Hmm, don't know about this. Yeah. I call bullshit. Like, there is aim assist in this. No, not controls. Uh, gameplay... Low. Can I not turn it all the way off? It's just low. Okay. I guess. Bitch, bye. That's it. Bag him attack. What? So Caden is almost dead too, but uh, I don't know how to help him because he's like, no, don't talk to me. <laughs> God. Eh. Eh. Mm. Yeah, run. Do, 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 do. <laughs> what you gonna do? Gunnery Chief Ashley Williams of the 212. You the one in charge here, sir? Her suit has boobs. Are you wounded, Williams? A few scrapes and burns. Nothing serious. The others weren't so lucky. Oh, man. We were patrolling the perimeter when the attack hit. We tried to get off a distress call, but they cut off our communications. I've been fighting for my life ever since. Where's the rest of your squad? We tried to double back to the beacon, but we walked into an ambush. I don't think any of the others... I think I'm the only one left. Hmm. Any idea what kind of enemy we're facing? I think they're Geth. The Geth haven't been seen outside the Vale in nearly 200 years. Why are they here now? They must have come for the beacon. The dig site is close, just over that rise. It might still be there. Okay. You're coming with us, Williams. We need that beacon. Aye, aye, sir. It's time for payback. Move out. Pistol. Pressing one or I, no. Opens equipment screen, which allows you to switch and modify weapons. Yes. Filter, yeah. Shepard, I want to keep his... I want to keep his, uh... Kessler? Hmm. Yeah, the pistol is worse. Yeah, everybody's got, like, better weapons. I don't need to do anything about that right now. It seems so, at least. The beacon's at the far end of this trench. Let's go. Let's go. What's that on the map? Is that enemies or no? It's my squad mates. Oh, 
Oh, he's behind the rock. What is that? What the hell? What the hell? Just All hit me. Well, these are aliens. They look like aliens. What the hell? Take the all. Level up. Yes, now I can level up the other guys. Sweet. Because <sighs> I spent all points on... Oh, wait. Oh, so they have individual points. Yeah, that's good though. It's the auto auto level up for um, auto level up on the squad. I think that's good because uh, I kind of think it's like I don't know what to do with all these guys. Hmm. Is he overkill? How would I use it? Assault training. What is that? Melee weapon damage. What the fuck was that? Something made a, made a noise in here. That was weird. Um, pistols. Do I need them? I don't know. I'm not quite sure. Um, I guess I want to check my inventory first. What I'm gonna... So Ashley... These are exactly the same. Hammer. It's a sniper rifle. The accuracy rating is worse than the ones we're using. Damage is slightly higher, but the accuracy rating is like everything for a sniper. And this has got like 35. Oh my god. What the hell? No, thank you. But how am I gonna how am I gonna spend my points with this guy? Mmm. I'm gonna do assault rifles first. And uh, maybe combat armor make it better. No, I can't level it up more. Oh. Okay. I guess. But the uh the skill thing. Oh, quick slots. No. Wait, how do I do that? Um, Shepherd details. No, back, back. How do I change the quick slots? Maybe that'll appear later. No. Maybe I could do something like, oh, help, settings, codex, maybe. Primary, secondary, player tutorials. I just want to check, like, the specific... The tactics HUD. Equipment. <clears throat> power icons the combat power but um at the top of the tactics hut of shepherd's power hotkey quick slots as shepherd levels up you gain new combat powers to add new power to your quick slots oh i can wait i could do it from the menu okay i'm gonna I'm gonna need to check that out. So if I go into not the inventory but the um <sighs> No, I can't drag it from here. No, yeah, I can't do that. Overkill. I want to be able to use it. 
it's not on my quick slots right now. I want to figure this out. Let's see. Nope. Tutorials. No. That's not what I meant. Uh, primary, no, secondary. Oh, the first aid power. That's good. F. R to throw a grenade. What? That's weird. What is reload? Do I not reload? Maybe this is a reload free weapon. I don't know. Okay. Uh, Caden, he needs... He needs health. So I want to... No, stop! No, okay. I think he's got everything he needs. Everything I could give him, at least. This is the dig site. The beacon was right here. It must have been moved. By who? Our side or the gas? Did you try Hard the to trickers? Maybe trickers we'll know more beach? After we check out the research camp. Hmm. Okay, let's go there. We make for the camp. <clears throat> it's just on the top of this ridge, up the ramps. Yep, let's check it out. But, um... There's a small spaceport up ahead. I want to check it out. I'll wait for you there. But, um, yeah, I want those quick slots to work, though. The filter tabs aren't helping me at all. Toggle helmet, yeah, I don't care about that. I'm just trying different quick buttons now. Quick buttons, I mean. Nope, that's inventory. That's okay. The quick slots. Nope. Um no. Okay, I need to figure this out. This the game won't tell me. And I'm not doing the whole I'm not doing the whole uh tutorial thing. I'm not doing that. Mass effect. Uh Jesus. Press and hold spacebar. What the fuck? Okay, but nowhere does that get explained. Like, ever. Okay, so let's see. I want to have... Not... What? I want shepherds, of course. What? He has, uh... He has the thing as well. Can I use theirs? But uh, where is Shepherds? I thought he had one. I was so sure he had his own. Like, why isn't that the assault rifle one? The overkill. I have it! I have the overkill. Why can't I use it? Why is it not here? Wait, is this? Yes. Oh, it's not that accurate. 
sorry, but no, I don't think I'm ready. I'm not ready. But uh, let's see. Uh, maybe throw sabotage. Caden has a pistol. Maybe untrained, untrained. So I need to train them in those fields before it's sort of a... Before it's, uh, uh, I guess, responsible. Shouldn't do it before. Wait, is this the right way? Yeah, I think so. Oh! Here's a container. Wait, did I not... Did I come down this way? No, this is the way I'm going up, right? I thought I might have... Didn't I come from this direction? I feel like I came from this direction. Yes, I did. Damn, come on. This is where we came from. Stupid. Oh, that's me. I'm stupid. This was my fault. Couldn't tell where I was supposed to go. Wait, why is there a flag here? Are we supposed to stop? It used to be beautiful here. Check your targets. Could be friendlies. I don't know why there's a flag there. Maybe because something happened? I guess we're going past this thing. And up here. I think so, yes. <clears throat> Caden still needs help though. Can 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 you stand still? There we go. God, he keeps Looks moving. Looks like they hit the camp hard. It's a good place Ooh. for an ambush. Keep your guard up. That looks horrible. Oh God, they're still alive. What did the Geth do to them? This is what I'm supposed to be using, right? Damn. Assault rifle, get you. Wee! Wee! Think we got him, Commander. Somebody's gonna pay for this. Somebody's gonna pay for this. Yeah, but who? Interesting. Aha! Loot! <laughs> that door is closed. Security locks engaged. What? Oh no. Oops. Override failed? What did I do? I tried. <sighs> did it fast. Gotta go fast. So, let's open this bitch up. Humans. Thank the Mick. Humans. Hurry, close the door before they come back. Hmm. Don't worry, we'll protect you. Thank you, I think we'll be okay now. It looks like everyone's gone. You're Dr. Warren, the one in charge of the excavation. Do you know what happened to the beacon? 
It was moved to the spaceport this morning. Manuel and I stayed behind to help pack up the camp. Manuel? When the attack came, the Marines held them off long enough for us to hide. They gave their lives to his, save us. Is that his No thing? one is saved. The age of humanity is ended. It doesn't Soon, look like a Manuel. Only ruin and corpses will remain. No. Hmm. Can you tell me anything about the beacon? It's some type of data module from a galaxy-wide communications network. Remarkably well-preserved. It could be the greatest scientific discovery of our lifetime. Miraculous new technologies, groundbreaking medical advances. Who knows what secrets are locked inside? We have unearthed the heart of evil. Awakened the beast. Unleashed the darkness. Manuel, please. This isn't the time. What else can you tell me about the attack? It all happened so fast. One second we were gathering up our equipment, the next we were hiding in the shed while the Geth swarmed over the camp. Agents of the Destroyers, bringers of darkness, heralds of our extinction. Yeah, we yeah. could hear the battle outside, gunfire, screams. I thought it would never end. Then everything went quiet. We just sat there, too afraid to and move. And everything changed. Until you came along. Okay. Yeah, Did you notice a Turian in the area? I saw him, the prophet, leader of the enemy. He was here before the attack. Before the attack? That's impossible. Nihilus was with us in the Normandy before the attack. He couldn't have been here. I I'm sorry. Manuel's still a bit hmm. unsettled. We haven't seen your Turian. We've been hiding in here since the attack. This is weird. I don't trust Nihilus anyways. But, uh... What's wrong with your assistant? Manuel has a brilliant mind, but he's always been a bit <laughs> unstable. Genius and madness are two sides of the same coin. Is it madness to see the future? To see the destruction rushing towards wow. us? To understand there is no escape? No hope? No. I am not mad. I'm the only sane one left. Yeah, right. I gave him an extra dose of his meds after the attack. An extra dose of his meds. No, I can shut him up. No, I won't. Goodbye. Williams, take us to the spaceport. You can't stop it. Nobody can stop it. Night is falling. The darkness of eternity. Hush, Manuel. Go lie down. You'll feel better once the medication kicks in. This guy is crazy. She's basically like telling us that he's crazy. She's like, yeah, he's a bit nuts. <laughs> but I guess that's the price of genius. So what are we doing? Oh, we're going around probably. Aha, there's the guy. It's his own people. Sarap. <gasps> Nihilus. This isn't your mission, Saren. What are you doing here? The Council thought you could use some help on this one. I wasn't expecting to find the Geth here. The situation's bad. Don't worry. I've got it under control. Oh no. Oh no! Use the overkill power to shoot rapidly and accurately. Yes, so now I can use it. Yes, I just had to use the right weapon. I'm gonna switch places with these two. It's a ship! Look at the size of it! Hmm!
can shoot quite far away. Wait, there's something over here. Maybe I can override the lock. I'm going to at least try. Is there anything in here? No. I'm gonna try. Stay calm out there. We're coming out. We're not armed. Is it safe? Are they gone? We took care of them. Those things were crawling all around the shed. They would have found us for sure. We owe you our lives. Ah. Uh, yes, you I do. I still can't believe it. When we saw that ship, I thought it was all over. It showed up right before the attack. I knew it was trouble the second I saw it. So we made a break for the sheds. Hmm. Tell me everything you remember about the attack. The three of us were working the crops when that ship showed up. We just saw it and ran. I don't know what happened to the rest of the crew. They were by the garage, over near the spaceport, right where that ship came down. No way they survived. You don't know that! We survived! If they made it to the garage, they could have had a fighting chance! Do you know anything about the Prothean beacon they dug up? We're just farmers. We heard they found something out there, but it never really mattered to us. Not until now. Mm. That's yes, true. What else can you tell me about the ship you saw? I was too busy running to get a clear look at it. I think it landed over near the spaceport. Tell them about the noise, Cole. That awful noise. What awful it noise? It was emitting some kind of signal as it descended. It sounded like the shriek of the damned. Only it was coming from inside your own head. Huh. It was probably trying to block communications. Whatever it was, it felt like it was tearing right through my skull. It almost made it impossible to think. I think I'm done there. Yeah. I have to go. Hey, Cole, we're just a bunch of farmers. These guys are soldiers. Maybe we should give them the stuff. Jeez, Blake, you've got to learn when to shut up. You have something to tell me, Cole? Some guys at the spaceport were running a small smuggling ring. Nothing major. In exchange for a cut of the profits, we let them store packages in our sheds. What kind of packages? I found a pistol. Figured it would come in handy if those things came back. But you'll probably get more use out of it than we will. I'll use my charms. We're risking our lives to save this colony. You sure there's nothing else in here that could help us out? Yeah, there's one more thing. Yes! I was gonna sell it after this was over, but you probably deserve it more than I do. Yes, I do. That is very right. Who's your contact at the spaceport, Cole? What's his name? He's not a bad guy. I don't want to get him in trouble. Besides, I'm not a snitch. He might have something to do with this whole attack, Cole. We need his name. It's important. Yeah, okay, you're right. His name's Powell. Works the docks at the spaceport if he's still alive. Hmm. Okay. I think we're good. I have to go. Good luck. I have to go. Hmm. <laughs> Combat sensor. Yes. I'm gonna take it all. Containment Come cell. Out. It's not us. Where? I mean, where are they seeing us? Oh, he's dead. He's dead. Something's moving over behind those crates. Wait! Don't, don't shoot! I'm one of you. I'm human. Sneaking up on us like that nearly got you killed. I, I'm sorry. I was hiding from those creatures. My name's Powell. I saw what happened to that Turian. The other one shot him. What the hell are you talking about? There were two Turians here. Your friend and another one he called Saren. I think they knew each other. Hmm. Your friend seemed to relax. He let his guard down. And Saren killed him. Shot him right in the back. I'm just lucky he didn't see me behind the crates. Where'd Saren go after he killed Nihilus? He jumped on the cargo train and headed over to the other platform. Probably going after the beacon. Hmm. I knew that beacon was trouble. Everything's gone to hell since we found it. First that damn mothership showed up, then the attack. They killed everyone. Everyone. If I had been behind the crates, I'd be dead too. 
Hmm. How come you're the only one who survived? Why didn't anyone else try to hide behind the crates? They never had a chance. I, I'm kind of starting I, to wonder about this I was this already too. behind the crates when the attack started. Mm -hmm. Mm hmm. Wait a minute. You were hiding behind the crates before the attack? I... Sometimes I need a nap to get through my shift. I... I sneak off behind the crates to grab 40 winks where the supervisor can't find me. You survived because you're lazy? Well... Is there anything else you can tell me about the beacon? They brought it here this morning. We loaded it up onto the train and shipped it to the other platform. Hard to believe that was only a few hours ago. Feels like a whole other life. Hmm. You're Cole's contact here on the docks. For the smuggling ring. Mm-hmm. What? No! I mean, what does it matter now? So I'm a smuggler, who cares? My supervisor's dead, the entire crew's dead. It doesn't matter now, does it? Anything hidden nearby that we could use against the Geth? A shipment of grenades came through last week. Nobody notices if a few small pieces go missing from the military orders. You greedy son of a bitch! We're out here trying to protect your sorry ass, and all you can think about is how you can rip us off? I never thought you'd actually need those grenades. Who'd want to attack Eden Prime? We're just a bunch of farmers. How was I supposed to know? Just give me the grenades. They're yours. Take them. My smuggling days are over, I swear. Hmm. Oh, I can't do that? Tell me about this mothership you saw. I I've never seen anything like it before. It... It was huge. Landed over near that platform. The whole place got dark as it came down. And... and it was making this noise, this... This sound that bored right into your brain. That's what woke me up. The attack came a few minutes later. Tell me about the Geth attack. It was quick. One minute that ship was descending, the next, those Geth were swarming over the platform. Thousands of them. They must have been inside that mothership. They shot anything that moved. It was a massacre. Okay. We need to find that beacon before it's too late. Let's go. Take the cargo train. That's where the other Turian went. I, I, I can't stay here. I need to get away from all this. Sure thing. That guy though. Fish posh. Oh, there are more. Where are the others? Oh wait, I missed my thing. He needs to start hiding. Isn't he dead? Caden. Caden. Stop so I can heal you. Okay, maybe I can't. I don't know. Oh. Oh yeah, I have to make him use the thing. I'm like, let me heal you! So I can order him to use the... Cool.
Oh, that's awesome. I can do that? This is amazing. This is awesome. Oh man, Caden. He did? Where is uh, the other one? There she is. Can't heal her, okay. And I can't use my shield charge, that's okay. Really? They did? <laughs> Bitch, really? Man. So both my teammates are actually dead. What am I supposed to do about this? Okay, so I absolutely didn't hit them. I guess I was just looking out for myself. Fatigued? Yeah. What? So did I lose because I lost my teammates maybe? This was difficult. Hey delicate, how are you doing? Wait, what am I doing? Oh yes, I'm taking the thing. Wait, did they come with me? Because they died though. <laughs> okay. I killed my teammates, but uh Set the charges. Destroy the entire colony. Leave no evidence that we were here. Do I have my teammates? Yes I do, but I have to heal this one. Caden um. should not be using the game, but he's untrained in the other ones. Damn it! Oh, I'm doing fine. Doing very well. Slept. I slept well last night and. Ah! Starting, uh, starting to play this. Haven't played it before.
uses her skills of her own, that's good, but she does need to boost up her shield now, and I want... No, it's okay, actually. Heal him like again. Okay. Damn it. Jammed. Caden. He needs to. He needs to move. Barrier. They need to stop dying. I'm sick and tired of this. Okay. This is... This is just annoying. Uh. Resume last save, of course. Demolition charges. The Geth must have planted them. Hurry! We need to find them all and shut them down. So if I want him to move, I need to check this out. So I want no not Ashley, Caden. Yeah, I want Caden to move. I want you to move over there. He doesn't move. Okay. Caden. Move. We should move, Commander. Yeah, but I no, hold position. Move. Two. Um. Wait. Move there. Yes! Sweet. Okay, so I can make him sort of hide and stuff like that, maybe, as well. <sighs> Caden, you need some. Damn it. Decryption. He needs the... Ah, oh, damn it. He should be leveling up his these skills. Ashley is okay, but uh, Caden, he keeps... Uh, he keeps dying. Like, they both do, but of course. As it is with... You need to heal. He doesn't want to heal. as well. That sucks. So he's he's not trained in anything else but the pistol. So he needs to keep using that. No. <clears throat> That's just terrible. Okay, so I can't heal him. That's uh that's a shame. 
my... What's jammed? Oh, yeah, just my... I guess it's just my map that's jammed. Okay, there we go. Dead. That is fantastic. Here. Can't even throw grenades anymore. Damn. Oh, this is where we came from. Shields. So he's fatigued again. That is just very fucking tasty. I lost shields! Seconds. So I have one left. I don't think I'll make it. Yeah, I think we're gonna lose this one. I didn't realize where we were gonna go to. But... And the whole planet blows up. Failed. Critical mission failure. Yes, I know. I know. I I can see the time ticking down. Yeah, we can do this. Demolition charges. The Geth must have planted them. Hurry! We need to find them all and shut them down. Okay, 
Hayden, what are you doing? No, I can't hit you anymore. That's okay. Now I'm making better time. <laughs> Charges disarmed. We did it, team. We did it. <laughs> Can I heal you now? Damn it. Yes, I could. Sweet. Keep losing health. Ugh. He is stressing me out. Oh my god. Ashley, you need to use your thing. I'm gonna do the same. I think we're done. Or Area secured. Done or done. I think we did it. Yeah. Uh, sorry about it. Normandy, the beacon is secure. This is amazing. Actual working Prothean technology. Unbelievable. It wasn't doing anything like that when they dug it up. Something must have activated it. Roger, Normandy. Standing by. Nope. <gasps> What's happening? Is she getting pulled in? Shepard! No, don't touch him! It's too dangerous! <gasps> Did I get some special powers, maybe? Superpowers. We identified oh, the tips. ship that touched down on Eden Prime. The Normandy, a human alliance vessel. It was under the command of Captain Anderson. They managed to save the colony. And the beacon. One of the humans may have used it. Why he's so mad? pissed over that must mean I get some sick powers then doctor dr. Chakwas I think he's waking up Chakwas that sounds like a bullshit name maybe it is 
You had us worried there, Shepard. How are you feeling? Hmm. Well, I'm okay. Minor throbbing. Nothing serious. How long was I out? About 15 hours. Something happened down there with the beacon, I think. It's my fault. I must have triggered some kind of security field when I approached it. You had to push me out of the way. Oh, don't blame yourself. I can't be like a douchebag. You were careless, no? You had no way to know what would happen. I never want to play as a douchebag. Actually, we don't even know if that's what set it off. Unfortunately, we'll never get the chance to find out. The beacon exploded. A system overload, maybe. The blast knocked you cold. The lieutenant and I carried you back here to the ship. Hmm. I appreciate it. Physically, you're fine. But I detected some unusual brain activity. Abnormal beta waves. I also noticed an increase in your rapid eye movement. Signs typically associated with intense dreaming. Hmm. I saw... I'm not sure what I saw. Death? Destruction? Nothing's really clear. Hmm. I better add this to my report. It may... Oh. Captain Anderson. How's our exo holding up, Doctor? Well, all the readings look normal. I'd say the commander's going to be fine. Glad to hear it. Shepard, I need to speak with you. In private. Ooh, in private. Aye, aye, Captain. I'll be in the mess if you need me. Sounds like that beacon hit you pretty hard, Commander. Are you sure you're okay? Hmm. I feel bad about Jenkins. Why is Williams here? I'll be stuck about the gath. Jenkins? Who was that? I don't remember who that was even. Chief Williams isn't part of the Normandy crew. I figured we could use a soldier like her. Hmm. She's been reassigned to the Normandy. Oh. Good. Williams is a good soldier. She deserves it. Lieutenant Elenko agrees with you. That's why I added her to our crew. You said you needed to see me in private, Captain? I won't lie to you, Shepard. Things look bad. Nihilus is dead. The beacon was destroyed and Geth are invading. The Council's going to want answers. Hmm. Council? Ugh. The Geth would have wiped out the whole colony if I hadn't stopped them. I'll stand behind you and your report, Shepard. You're a damned hero in my books. That's not why I'm here. It's Saren, that other Turian. Hmm. Saren's a specter, one of the best, a living legend. But if he's working with the Geth, it means he's gone rogue. A rogue specter's trouble. Saren's dangerous. And he hates humans. Why? He thinks we're growing too fast, taking over the galaxy. Hmm. A lot of aliens think that way. Most of them don't do anything about it. But Saren has allied himself with the Geth. I don't know how. I don't know why. Don't I only know it had something to do with that know beacon. Why. <laughs> you were there just no. before that beacon self-destructed. Did you see anything? Any clue that might tell us what Saren was after? Hmm. Not sure. Just before I lost consciousness, I had some kind of vision. A vision? A vision of what? Yeah, what was it exactly? A warning, maybe? I saw synthetics. Geth, maybe. Slaughtering people. Butchering them. We need to report this to the Council, Shepard. What are we going to tell him? I had a bad dream? We don't know what information was stored in that beacon. Lost Prothean technology? Blueprints for some ancient weapon of mass destruction? Whatever it was. Saren took it. But I know Saren. I know his reputation, his politics. He believes humans are a blight on the galaxy. This attack was an act of war. Hmm. He has the secrets from the beacon. He has an army of Geth at his command. I would kind of agree, though, stop that, when, that like, uh, from humans the face are of the a blight on the galaxy. We are a blight on the Earth, so why not be a blight on the galaxy? Hmm. 
Hmm. I'll find some way to take him down. It's not that easy. He's a specter. He can go anywhere, do almost anything. That's why we need the council on our side. We prove Saren's gone rogue and the council will revoke his specter status. I'll contact the ambassador and see if he can get us an audience with the council. He'll want to see us as soon as we reach the Citadel. We should be getting close. Head up to the bridge and tell Joker to bring us into dock. Hey, Commander. I want to talk to you, Ashley. I'm glad you're okay, Commander. The crew could use some good news after what happened to Jenkins. Oh, Jenkins. Yeah, that's the soldier who was dead, I think. Jenkins was a valuable part of this crew. Part of me feels guilty over what happened. I forgot about Jenkins. Jenkins is still alive. I might not be here. You're a good soldier, Williams. You belong on the Normandy. Thanks, Commander. I appreciate that. Things were pretty rough down there. Are you okay? I've seen friends die before comes with being a marine but to see my whole unit wiped out and you never get used to seeing dead civilians but things would have been a lot worse if you hadn't shown up well you you helped couldn't have done it without you Williams thanks commander I have to admit I was a little worried about being assigned to the Normandy <sighs> it's nice when someone makes you feel welcome what have you I think you're gonna fit in here just fine Williams Thanks, Commander. I want to build some reputation. Yeah, it's just that, um... Let's see, where am I going? I'm going to... No, not the... It's not the sleeping pods. Oh well, I might as well just, uh... Do some exploring. I'm, I'm not gonna be the douchebag on this one. <gasps> hmm. Hi. What's this? Ooh. Oh, I got some new. What's hey, this? Hey, Commander. Looking for some extra supplies before you head out? Supplies? What have you got? Whatever you want. Armor, weapons, mods. It's not standard Alliance issue, but that's not necessarily a bad thing. Well, as long as you don't mind paying for it. Why should I pay you for my weapons and armor? My stuff doesn't come from the Alliance. I have to purchase it myself, and it's not cheap. Hell, the licenses alone have set me back more than I'd like. But no licenses, no goods. Without the goods, I'm out of a job. Okay. Let's see what you've got. You bet, Commander. Hmm. Oh. Yeah, I don't have nearly enough to buy any of this, probably. I mean, where's this? Field integrity. Engineer Adams. Oh, I'm supposed to talk to Joker. Lol, Joker. What kind of name is that? He had to be bullied when he was little. I'm just guessing. Let's take the elevator. Let's see, uh... No. I'm not... Okay. Quarters. So I took this elevator. If I take the elevator up here... 
No, this is just a door. Wow, I get saluted, even. Navigator Presley, there we go, Joker. Isn't uh, he one of these guys? There we go. Hey, Joker. Good timing, Commander. I was just about to bring us into the Citadel. See that taxpayer money at work. That cut off a bit awkwardly. <laughs> the Citadel. No. Me? Outside it? Size isn't everything. Why so touchy, well, Joker? Size isn't saying, everything. Just saying, you need firepower too. Lord. Yeah, that's a huge Look at that monster. Ship. Its main gun could rip through the barriers in any ship in the Alliance fleet. Good thing it's on our side then. Ha. Huh. Citadel Control, this is SSV Normandy requesting permission to land. Stand by for clearance, Normandy. Clearance granted. You may begin your approach. Transferring you to an Alliance operator. Roger, Alliance Tower. Tower, please proceed to dock 422. This is so cool. Oh, this is This amazing. is an outrage! The Council would step in if the Geth attacked a Turian colony? Yeah. The Turians don't found colonies on the borders of the Terminus systems, Ambassador. Humanity was well aware of the risks when you went into the Traverse. What about Saren? You can't just ignore a rogue specter. I demand action! You don't get to make demands of the Council, Ambassador. Wow. Citadel Security is investigating your charges against Saren. We will discuss the CSEC findings at the hearing, not before. Newsbags. Captain Anderson, I see you brought half your crew with Mr. you. Mr. Anderson. Just the ground team from Eden Prime, in case you had any questions. I have the mission reports. I assume they're accurate? I they have are. the record. Sounds like you convinced the Council to give us an audience. They were not happy about it. Seren's their top agent. They don't like him being accused of treason. Seren's a threat to every human colony out there. If they don't stop him, I will. Settle down, Commander. You've already done more than enough to jeopardize your candidacy for the Spectres. What? The mission on Eden Prime was a chance to prove you could get the job done. Instead, Nihilus ended up dead and the beacon was destroyed. That wasn't my fault, That's though. Saren's fault, not his. Then we better hope the CSEC investigation turns up evidence to support our accusations. Otherwise, the Council might use this as an excuse to keep you out of the Spectres. Come with me, Captain. I want to go over a few things before the hearing. <laughs> Shepard, you and the others can meet us at the Citadel Tower, top level. I'll make sure you have clearance to get in. Asshole. And that's why I hate politicians. <laughs> <laughs> Me too. Me too, sister. Me too. Let's go there. Ooh. Let's see. We're going to the what? <laughs> Emporium? Citadel Tower. Okay, so we have to... And we are... Yeah, we're going out... Wait, what? We're going out here... And then we're taking a left... I think... Yeah, we're just gonna follow the... wait, what? Yeah. This is so cool! Oh, hello! 
Good day, Commander. The human ambassador is up the stairs, first room on the right. You know who I am? Yes, I receive reports on all newly arrived dignitaries and notable people. Hmm. What's your name? What do you do here? My name is Sephiria. I'm the administrative assistant for the embassies. You seem to be distracted. The embassies are the hub of all civil <coughs> politics. When you represent trillions of citizens, it tends to get a little busy. Wow. Okay. Bye. I should be going now. Have a pleasant day. Welcome to the She was low key Hello. sassing me, but okay. So we need to go up here and to the right. I'm terrible at reading maps, but okay. Ooh. Yeah, we can do this. Citadel Tower. Don't want to walk the whole way. Damn. Saren's hiding something. Give me more time. Stall them. Stall the council? Don't be ridiculous. Your investigation is over, Garrus. Ooh. Ooh. Commander Shepard, Garrus Vicarian. I was the officer in charge of the CSEC investigation into Saren. Hmm. Come across anything I should know about? Saren's a specter. Most of his activities are classified. I couldn't find anything solid. But I know he's up to something. Like you humans say, I feel it in my gut. I think the Council's ready for us, Commander. Good luck, Shepard. Maybe they'll listen to you. Oof. Yeah, what am I gonna say, though? I can't prove it. I can't prove the Saren's a bad egg. It's just like... I don't know! I honestly don't know how to prove that he is, uh, that he's guilty. How would I? No, light you just don't like them because you have trouble understanding them. Can I travel with this now? Embassies? No. Back. I can... I need to find the top of... Tip the top of the tower. Wait, what? Admiral Kahuku? Kahoku? Hello? No, I'm waiting to speak with one of the Council's assistants. Commander. Okay, he doesn't want to talk to me. That's understandable. I think this might be the way. I'm just walking. <gasps> Captain Anderson. Hearing's already started. Come on. <gasps> okay. Didn't realize I was late. God. The Geth attack is a matter of some concern. But there is nothing to indicate Saren was involved in any way. Oh, the investigation man. by Citadel Security turned up no evidence to support your charge of treason. An eyewitness saw him kill Nihilus in cold blood. We've read the Eden Prime reports, Ambassador. The testimony of one traumatized dock worker is hardly compelling proof. I resent these accusations. Nihilus was a fellow specter and a friend. That just let you catch him off guard. Captain Anderson. You always seem to be involved when humanity makes false charges against me. Hmm. And this must be your protege, Commander Shepard. The one who let the beacon get destroyed. You're the one who destroyed the beacon. Then you tried to cover it up. Shift the blame to cover your own failures. Just like Captain Anderson. He's taught you Wow. Well. But what can you expect from a human? Saren despises humanity. That's why he attacked Eden Prime. Your species needs to learn its place, Shepard. You're not ready to join the Council. You're not even ready to join the Spectres. He has no right to say that. That's not his decision. 
Shepard's admission into the Spectres is not the purpose of this meeting. This meeting has no purpose. Ooh. The humans are wasting your time. Sorry, is a rude motherfucker. Saren's hiding behind his position as a Spectre. You need to open your eyes. What we need is evidence. So far, we've seen nothing. There is still one outstanding issue. Commander Shepard's vision. It may have been triggered by the beacon. Are we allowing dreams into evidence now? How can I defend my innocence against this kind of testimony? I agree. Our judgment must be based on facts and evidence, not wild imaginings and reckless speculation. Do you have anything else to add, Commander Shepard? No. You've made your decision. I won't waste my breath. The Council has found no evidence of any connection between Saren and the Geth. Ambassador, your petition to have him disbarred from the Spectres is denied. I'm glad to see justice was served. This meeting is adjourned. Oh my god, he's evil! You can see it. On his face. It was a mistake bringing you into that hearing, Captain. You and Saren have too much history. It made the Council question our motives. I know Saren. He's working with the Geth for one reason. To exterminate the entire human race. Every colony we have is at risk. Every world we control is in danger. Even Earth isn't safe. Even Earth? Tell me about this history between you and Saren. I worked with him on a mission a long time ago. Things went bad. Real bad. Hmm. We shouldn't talk about this here. But I know what he's like. And he has to be stopped. Hmm. We need to deal with Saren ourselves. As a Spectre, he's virtually untouchable. We need to find some way to expose him. What about Garrus, that CSEC investigator? We saw him arguing with the Executor. Yeah. That's right. He was asking for more time to finish his report. Seems like he was close to finding something on Saren. Yeah. Any idea where we could find him? I have a contact in CSEC who can help us track Garrus down. His name is Harkin. Forget it. They suspended Harkin last month, drinking on the job. I won't waste my time with that loser. You won't have to. I don't want the Council using your past history with Saren as an excuse to ignore anything we turn up. Shepard will handle this. Yeah. Yeah, I think that's better. I'll take care of it. I need to take care of some business. They uh, captain, will probably in interpret it as Vendetta if he... If Harkin's the captain probably getting takes drunk care of it. Corey's den. It's a dingy little club in the lower section of the wards. Maybe there's another way to find evidence against Sarah. You should talk to Barla Vaughn over in the financial district. Rumor has it he's an agent for the Shadow Broker. The Shadow Broker? An information dealer. Buys and sells secrets to the highest bidder. Hmm. I've heard Balavan's one of the top representatives. He might know something about Saren, but his information won't come cheap. You and Saren have a history. What happened? About 20 years ago, I was part of a mission in the Skillian Verge. I was working with Saren to find and remove a known terrorist threat. Saren eliminated his target, but a lot of people died along the way, innocent people. And the official records just covered hmm. it all up. But I saw how he operates. No conscience. No hesitation. He'd kill a thousand innocent civilians to end a war without a second thought. So would I. <laughs> Killing innocents doesn't end wars. It causes them. I know how the world works, Commander. Sometimes you're forced to make unpleasant decisions. But only if there's no other way. Saren doesn't even look for another option. He's twisted, broken. He likes the violence, the killing. And he knows how to cover his tracks. He's Killing lost. innocents doesn't end wars. Oh, yeah. It causes them. Look. I know how the world works, Commander. Sometimes you're forced to make unpleasant decisions. <laughs> Just kept decisions, spinning on the same But only if there's no other way. Oh, yeah. Saren doesn't even look for another option. He's twisted, broken. He likes the violence, the killing. And he knows how to cover his tracks. I should go. Good luck, Shepard. I'll be over in the ambassador's office if you need anything else. Okay.
So where am I going? <sighs> Hold on, I'm just getting something to eat. Hey. Oh, it's nothing proper, but I need to just eat something. <sighs> Boo just woke up. Why boo? That's great, man. Waking up at two, that's awesome. Why boo? Oh, yeah. <laughs> no. No, it's okay. I've only just made it to the hearing. No, yeah. Mm. So we just had the hearing uh, accusing Saren of being a rogue specter, which of course failed because um, I have no evidence and I had a fucking dream. Like that's gonna prove anything. I have a dream. Oh yeah, and the beacon thing. Everybody's gonna blame me for destroying the beacon, even though it was Saren who did it. So, that's kind of messed up. Hey, who's this? That guy's up to something. What guy? This guy. The one over by the keeper. <laughs> what? Oh, no, I wasn't. Never mind. Oh, what? Um, Yes, is there something you want? Why are you so interested in the keepers? Keepers? I've got no interest in the keep. <laughs> Don't get coy. I know what I saw. I, uh... I'm not so sure I should be talking to you about this. Just tell me what you're doing. I'm not here to get you into trouble. Alright. I guess it wouldn't hurt to tell you. I'm using a small scanner to gather readings on the keepers. So far I've had mixed results. I find it difficult to get near the creatures. Hmm. But why? Why were you being so secretive about it, though? Well, technically we're not supposed to disturb the Keepers. I don't really think my scanning disturbs them, but the authorities might disagree. Hmm. I'd like to do it more openly, but it's not really worth getting arrested over. <laughs> Let me help? Uh, no. I'm going. Yeah, I'm not gonna help this guy do so something long. something potentially illegal. No, thank you. Yeah, this game is 13 years old. It's insane. Where am I going? Can you can travel with this? I'm getting old. Yeah, me too. Wards location. Chorus Den. No, wait. Was that the club? Yeah, we're the same age, remember? So if you're getting old, I'm getting old too. Is this the knife club? What? This is a freaky looking knife club, I have to say. Moreland. Hello there. Welcome to Moreland's famous shop. Don't it me. Good supplies. Yes. <laughs> Goodbye. Yes. All right then. Good Need tidings something. to you, human. Did he just call me a human? So where's the uh, where's the guy? The informant. There's a second floor. Hello. Oh no, thank you. But what? This ain't the nightclub, no. 
Hello, good morning, hunty. I'm looking. Hello, I'm looking for this guy. These guys are hanging out like in weird places. This is a different part of the club. Is it a part of the club? Me, oh my god, what? I'm Emily Wong. Ooh. I'm an investigative journalist What's that dress? working here on the Citadel. Could I have a moment of your time? Oh my god, look at her freaking dress. Ah. Uh. Mm, no. I don't have time to give interviews, Ms. Wong. I don't want an interview. I'm looking for information. No. Nope. I've been hunting for evidence of corruption and organized crime on the Citadel, but there are places I can't go. I was hoping you might share anything you find during your own investigation. I can make it worth your time. No, I can't. I'm here to do my job, not yours. Goodbye, Ms. Wong. I see, Commander. I apologize. <laughs> Risk of rain. Yeah, I'm not surprised. Breaking news. Yeah, you've, you've been playing that a lot lately, so... Codex? Got some newer information there, I can't tell. Wait, scenic view. The market's in Chorus Den. I still need to be in Chorus Den. <laughs> Left us in the cold, what? <laughs> Lol. Because he started playing Risk of Rain, you're right. Is that the thing I'm supposed to talk to? Best place on this board to buy upgrades. No. What the hell is this? Ew. Hello, Earth Clan. No doubt you've just come back from the colonies. Will you be needing supplies? Show me what you've got. Most excellent. I am sure you will find something pleasing. Excuse me, it's a phallus. Oh, yeah. I don't have enough money to buy anything anyways. This guy. You're Commander Shepard. Is that the guy the I'm talking to? The hero of Eden Prime. I am so honored to meet you. Ew. Do I know you? Uh, no. No, I'm just a fan. One of your biggest fans, actually. My name is Conrad. Conrad Werner. They say you killed more than a hundred Geth on Eden Prime. Suck my dick, why don't you? Mm. Nah. I spend most of mm -hmm. the time trying to stay alive and help mm. the colonists. Hey, I know you're probably busy, but um, do you have time for a quick autograph? Yeah, I suppose. Here you go. Thanks. I really appreciate it. My wife is going to be so impressed. Ugh. I'll let you get back to work. Oh, but next time you're on Earth, I'd love to buy you a drink. <laughs> Thanks again. Yeah, right. His wife. Let's check our journal. The fan. What? He seemed like he seemed like a harmless fan. Mm. Well, you told Emily Wong that you didn't want to help her find information. You might still run across something of interest. I'm still going to look for information. Yeah, but assignments, missions. Missions. There we go. <sighs> Go to the tower, I did that. Investigate Saren, that's what I'm doing. Citadel, Garrus, speak to Harkin. Um But Harkin doesn't say where Harkin is. Turian. Oh, so I know at least what it looks like. Or the shadow broker. Barla.
No, I think I think Harkin was. Uh, no, but he was uh, he was supposed to be here, like at the in the bar. He was supposed to be in the bar, but uh, maybe you're thinking about the other one. Like uh, I don't know, not Harkin maybe, but one of these two guys was supposed to be in the bar. I know that. But uh, I guess since I'm not finding him, I might as well just go back. The security guy? Yeah, maybe. Wards? Is that? Uh, no, that's the one I'm in right now. Let's see, I'm going to the embassies. Seasick Academy, maybe this, yeah, this is the way. Yeah, of course then, that's where I was, but uh, I didn't find anyone to talk to, so I'm thinking it doesn't necessarily have to be there. Okay, I guess, uh, I guess I'm taking the elevator. Is the elevator running? How you holding up, Lieutenant? Not too bad. No headaches worth mentioning lately. Maybe I'm getting used to the strain. Maybe you've just got a good stress release. I know that knocking the gaff on their synthetic asses gets rid of my headaches. Hidden loading screen, yeah. And the music is like, yeah, this is elevator music, all right. Hello? Sweet, now we're here. <clears throat> I think we're in the right place. Oh, who's this? This is not the guy, is it? One sec, looking you up. Requisition officer. Commander Shepard, here with the Alliance military. First time on the Citadel, that about right? Sure is. How did you know all that? I'm the CSEC requisitions officer. I need to make sure our buyers are authorized. So, will you be purchasing anything today, Commander Shepard? I think I'll be going. Sure thing, Commander. You have a good day now. Sure thing, Commander. The way he's running upstairs seems like it's really heavy. He's like, uh, uh, uh. No, no, the way he's running in general is like, seems like he is super heavy. Yeah, let's take this uh, weird elevator. Do, 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 do. I feel In light like... of the recent attack on Eden Prime, many colonial investors are pulling their support for future projects. Proponents of expanded human colonization insist that Eden Prime was an isolated case. Nevertheless, colonist enrollment has dropped sharply. Yes, I do think many running upstairs is heavy, but until backers have some reassurance that human colonies He's a soldier. Will be he shouldn't protected. he shouldn't uh, feel <laughs> like that's heavy. <laughs> I'm very opinionated on that matter. Uh, despite the fact that I myself get tired very easily. <laughs> Is that hypocritical? Maybe. Hey, who's this? Officer Lang. Hey, I know you. You're Shepard, right? Oh my god. I saw the monument guys. at a coos. They got a whole section about you there. It's a miracle you survived. Looks like you have a fan. I'm sorry, I just never thought I'd meet someone like you in person. 
Uh, my name's Lang. Officer Eddie Lang, Citadel Security. It's an honor to meet you, Commander. What are you doing down here in the wards? Anything I can help you with? Uh, goodbye. I have to go. Right. You're probably no. real busy. Well, see you around, Commander. Uh, holster your fucking weapon. Okay, I can't do that. Okay. What's this? Ooh. Hey, wait. What is this? Eh. I was trying to reholster, but that was really difficult. This is the same place that I was before. Really? Did I just travel? I could have just gone from the club and over to this place. Really, bitch? Uh, med clinic. What's this? Oh, that's the view. Mm. Oh, that's seems like an inactive door. I just want to look around now. Ooh. Hello there, Commander. I'm Dr. Chloe Michel. Is there something I can do for you? Oh, I hate her accent. Eek. Personal question. Ooh. You're a doctor. How did you end up here on the Citadel? My parents brought me here when I was young. My father was a medic with the Alliance. I chose to keep the medical tradition alive, but not the military. Fixing up wounded soldiers isn't my idea of fun. Lol. I'll be going now. Goodbye, Commander. Nice talking to you. She has a nice French accent. But it, it wasn't discreet, I can tell you that much. So... Yeah. So I can't go in here though. I'm just gonna see if there's any new points of travel. No, I don't think so. Med clinic, I was just there. So I'm just gonna check my quest log again. Garrus, speak to Harkin. Sees a cage who might know. Go to Chorus then in the lower wards and speak with Harkin. Yeah, I. I did that. You have to be more specific. Where is he? In the club? Because I was I was there before and he was not there. To markets and chorus then. Somewhere? Yeah, maybe. Yeah, I'm gonna keep checking. He should be there. Shouldn't be so hard to find. Hello? Hello? Maybe he's... No. That's not him. I was like, no, there's a sign. No, but that's not him. That's not him. Is this him? No. <laughs> One of these guys? No. Okay, maybe I can get some information out of the Hello there. Uh, Welcome bartenders. to Moreland's famous shop. You want many good supplies, yes? An elevator Goodbye. to the wards? Yes, okay. alright then. Good tidings to you, human. Uh, okay. Let's see. The lower markets... No, Chorus Den! I was at the Chorus Den. 
What? So I guess uh, I guess I found it. Oops. Didn't take too much time to find them. Ooh. Ooh. Look at her. <laughs> oh, my God. Oh my god, can I sit down and watch this? <gasps> oh, hello. Relax, lol. What? <laughs> sit forward, lol. How you doing, baby? Can't sit here forever. Maybe a private lap dance? No? <laughs> and my squad is just like, ah, oh, when is he gonna finish? Ew. Like a couple sitting there, just like, and she's like dancing in front of them. Trying to hide his wood. Lol. Just like, sit up, sit up straight. <laughs> sit forward. <laughs> hide your boner. Go away. I'm not interested in talking. Sure thing. Who's this then? Not now. I'm watching the show. show. Back off, Rex. Fizz told us to take you down if you showed up. What are you waiting for? I'm standing right here. This is Fizz's only chance. If he's smart, he'll take it. He's not coming out, Rex. End of story. The story Ooh. is just beginning. Is shit about to go down? Out of my way, humans. I have no rules. Oh, oh, my that humans. Who knows? Let's just try not to get caught in the middle. You know, caught in the middle. Da -da -da -da. Parkin, there we go. Alliance military. <laughs> I could have been a marine. Jason you know. Statham? Instead, I joined the goddamn oh, Citadel oh, Security. Jason Statham, I love your work, man. Can I get your autograph, buddy? What? He doesn't sound like him, but he definitely looks like him. What the hell? That's fucking Jason Statham. Let's see. Uh, hmm. Where's Garrus? I'm looking for a CSEC officer, a Turian named Garrus. <laughs> Garrus? <laughs> you must be one of Captain Anderson's crew. Poor bastard, still trying to bring Saren down, eh? I know where Garrus is. You gotta tell me something. First, did the captain let you in on his big secret? What secret? Ooh, I want to know. Is there something I should know about the captain? The captain used to be a specter. What? You didn't know that, did you? It was all very hush hush. Hmm. The first human ever given that honor, and then he blew it. What did he blow it on? <laughs> screwed up his mission so bad they kicked him out. Of course, he blames because Saren. of Saren. Says the Turians set him up. What? They're closing the stores at 16? Wait, what time is it now? <laughs> okay, yeah, that's fine. I'll be on for another 45 minutes though, so if you get back before I'm done, I'll see you then. But uh, that's okay. I totally get you. I have to go to the store myself, but I have time since it's right down the road. <laughs> So, screwed up his mission. So, yeah, I would blame Saren too, because it's his fault. Hmm, how do you know this? You said they covered all this up. How'd you hear about it? I spent 20 years working cases here on the Citadel. People on this station love to talk. Secrets are like herpes. You got them, you 
Might as well spread them around. Ew. Lol. <laughs> that was very, very decadently <laughs> put by him. What wrong? Why'd they kick him out? Have to ask him. I never heard any of the details. That it's a good story, though. The hero's fall. Classic tragedy. Ah, ah. Ah, ah. Okay. Yeah. Just tell me where Garrus went. Garrus was sniffing around Dr. Michelle's office. She runs the med clinic on the other side. The of clinic. Unless I heard he was going back there. What's it like working for CSEC? You mean, what was it like? Executor suspended me without pay. Recurring violations. CSEC was keeping a file on me. Can you believe that? Every mistake I ever made went into the books. Get a little rough with a suspect, note in the file. Have a couple of drinks on duty, note in the file. Skim a couple of credits off a drug bus, note in the file. It's a goddamn witch hunt. Hmm. You got off easy, if you ask me. What the hell do you know? Working for C-Sec isn't like being a Marine. People get pissed off if we shoot somebody. Investigations, inquiries, rules, regulations. Yeah, there has to be rules and regulations. God damn it. Enough red tape to choke a rhino. That's how you gotta be to do this job. So don't talk to me about right and wrong. You soldiers got it easy. Wow. Goodbye. I'm, I'm done with this. Yeah, good. Blaming Go. game. <laughs> Fucking hell. This guy. Oh, I want to talk to this the guy. The back rooms are private, reserved for <laughs> Fist and his friends. What did that other Krogan want? Rex? Personal matter. Not real chatty, is he? Who's Fist? He owns this club, but the customers have to stay out front. <laughs> Goodbye. <laughs> Enjoy the club. Oh, I hear a woman back here. <laughs> That's like what? Yeah. I did not need to hear that. Oh, but these ladies though. How much money can you make dancing in a cage like this, or up on the? In this case, like on the roof of the bar, I guess. How much money do you? Make on that. They dance well. Mm. Why didn't Captain Anderson tell us he used to be a Spectre? Maybe it's not true. Harkin's an ass. Bet he's just messing with her head. Yeah, but it's kind of hard to tell if he's just messing with us or if he's actually telling the truth. Maybe he was telling the truth. Let's uh, travel to the med med thing if we can. Forge locations. Med clinic. You have arrived at the medical center in the wards. Bitty bitty bitty. Let's go in here. I didn't tell anyone, I swear. That was smart, dog. Now if Garrus comes around, you stay smart. Keep your mouth shut or we'll... <gasps> Who are you? Yeah. Let her go. Surprise, motherfucker. Ah! Wow, he could have hit her easily, but he didn't. What? Who are you? Okay. They must be dead now. No? Yep. They be dead. Perfect timing, Shepard. Gave me a clear shot at that bastard. You took him down clean. Sometimes you get lucky. Dr. Michelle, are you hurt? No, I'm okay. Thanks to you. All of you. Why were they threatening you? Who do they work for? They work for Feast. They wanted to shut me up, keep me from telling Garrus about the Quarian. Quarian? What Quarian? 
A few days ago, a quarian came by my office. She'd been shot, but she wouldn't tell me who did it. I could tell she was scared, probably on the run. She asked me about the Shadow Broker. She wanted to trade information in exchange for a safe place to hide. Where is she now? I put her in contact with Fist. He's an agent for the Shadow Broker. Not anymore. Now he works for Saren. Hmm. The Shadow Broker isn't too happy about it. Fist betrayed the Shadow Broker? That's stupid even for him. Saren must have made him quite the offer. That Quarian must have something Saren wants. Something worth crossing the Shadow Broker to get. She must have something that proves he's a traitor. Did the Quarian mention anything about Saren or the Geth? She did. The information she was going to trade. She said it had something to do with the Geth. Mm. She must be able to link Saren to the Geth. There is no way the Council can ignore this. Time we paid Fist a visit. This is your show, Shepard. But I want to bring Saren down as much as you do. I'm coming with you. Hmm. You're a Turian. Why do you want to bring him down? I couldn't find the proof I needed in my investigation, but I knew what was really going on. Saren is a traitor to the Council and a disgrace to my people. Hmm. Welcome aboard, Garrus. You know, we aren't the only ones going after Fist. The Shadow Broker hired a Krogan bounty hunter named Rex to take him out. Yeah, we saw him in the bar. Hmm. Rex? Hmm, we could a use Krogan him. might come in handy. Last I heard, he was at the CSEC Academy. What's he doing there? Fist accused him of making threats. We brought Rex in for a little talk. If you hurry, you can catch him at the Academy before he leaves. Move out. Oh, now we have a new Gary's yes, current squad. Yeah, boy. Accept squad. I don't need to. What? What? Oh no! I can't just. I can just use two. Me and Garrus are going. If you feel lucky, we should visit the casino all the time. But um What? Okay, I guess this is who I'm bringing. Seasick Academy, where are we going? Let's see, this is this is going to the docking bay. Yeah, I think uh I think we'll be able to catch him. Well, Garrus, any regrets about leaving Citadel Security? Fighting a rogue specter with countless lives at stake and no regulations to get in the way? I'd say that beat Seasick. <laughs> well, we don't lack for excitement, that's for sure. Hmm. the Normandy. No, I wasn't going here. Was I? Oh, 
Oh, this is the Normandy. Uh, this is not right. Okay, let's see what the journal says. Citadel Rex, go see. Rex, bounty hunter, is being questioned at Seasick Academy. He's been questioned. Okay, so he's not at the docking bay, I guess. Let's just see if we can find him. Elevator. Ready, bitches? I didn't press it. Okay, now I did. <laughs> a Solarian excavation team has run into an unexpected problem after unearthing a Prothean dig site. Hanar protesters have blockaded the dig site, claiming that artifacts of the Enkindlers, as the Hanar call them, should not be disturbed. The excavation team has appealed to Hanar representatives on the Citadel to reach a diplomatic solution. A diplomatic solution. <laughs> yeah. We will see about that. So we need to find this. Oi! There it is. There it is. There he Witnesses is. Witnesses saw you making threats in Fist's bar. Stay away from him. I don't take orders from you. Ooh. This is your only warning, Rex. You should warn Fist. I will kill him. Wow. You want me to arrest you? I want you to try. Go on. Get out of here. Do I know you, human? Hmm. My name's Shepard. I'm going after Fist. Thought you might want to come along. <sighs> Shepard. Commander Shepard. I've heard a lot about you. Of course We're he both has. warriors, Shepard. Out of respect, I'll give you a fair warning. I'm going to kill Fist. Fist knows you're coming. We'll have a better chance if we all work together. My people have a saying. Seek the enemy of your enemy, and you will find a friend. Hmm. Glad to have you on the team, Rex. Let's go. I hate to keep Fist waiting. Lol. So, I need him. And... I want Garrus. Wait, can I only... Why can I only choose two? I'm gonna leave my humans behind. I'm sorry. Sorry, humans. No, maybe I should have one left that's mine. <laughs> you know. Combat strength. Ooh, this is good. I get like a total... Total sort of uh, value of... So if I combine... I need more of a sort of more tech strength and combat strength. No, I need combat strength right now, I think. I'm gonna leave Garrus. I don't entirely trust him right now. So this seems like a good fit. I think, yeah. So, bringing these two. Let's see, where are we going? Exposed Saren. Yeah, we're still working on that. We need to go to... Yeah, he's hiding out in that uh, place. The Chorus Den. Not the Chorus Den, but he's hiding in Chorus Den. So. We are going to Chorus Den. This game is really cool. Uh, and it doesn't seem to be that old, despite the fact that it's actually 13 years old. It's insane. Crazy how old this game is. And it looks I think it looks great. Looks like it shut down. What's shut this down? Look out! What the fuck? I wasn't prepared for this. Yeah, we're going in. I've lost shields! Need of the, these guys. No, I can't. Enemy is everywhere. Enemy is everywhere. Why am 
I not using my main weapon? Maybe I need to start practicing. does Rex have? He has the barrier warp. Ooh. Shield boost, yeah, the regular. That's cool. Hey, what's this? Yeah, I don't know. Is it a weapon? Enemy contact! Stop right there! Don't come any closer! Maybe I need to practice with the other weapons. Lancer, Storm, Avenger. This is a good one. No, now it's more of a short range thing, so. Oh yeah, boy! I love this. This is inside, it's okay, All I guess. Fire. These guys can take care of themselves, that's good. Okay, I don't have grenades. I guess I'm out. the quarian she's not here i don't know where she is that's the truth he's no use to you now let me kill him wait wait i don't know where the quarian is but i know where you can find her the quarian isn't here said you'd only deal with the shadow broker himself hmm. face to face impossible even i was hired through an agent nobody meets the shadow broker ever even i don't know his true identity but she didn't know that. I told her I'd set a meeting up. But when she shows up, it'll be Saren's men waiting for her. <gasps> Tell me where that meeting is before I blow your lying head off. Here on the wards, the back alley by the markets. She's supposed to meet them right now. You can make it if you hurry. Oh my god! What? The shadow broker paid me to kill him. I don't leave jobs half done. A lot of people died because of him. He had it coming. 
Now let's move. We have to save yeah, that quarry. Yeah, he, he told me beforehand he was gonna kill him, so... <laughs> Can't take that as a surprise, really. Ooh. Override. Yes. Take all. Can I do something with this, um... Omni gel. Ammo upgrade. Let's see. Banshee. Hmm. Shots before overheat, that's not too bad, but then the damage output is quite great. <sighs> It's an assault rifle. Hmm, this one is actually better. Yeah, Caden specializes in, in these weapons, so I should switch. How do I do that? No, equip it. Yes. Sniper? No, he doesn't use snipers. Hmm. I can I can control the overheating, I think. Not sure, but I think so. Switch the rifle. It looks better. See a Krogan? Oh, he has a cool helmet though. Biotic protection, that's good though. No, but he has he has that focus for a reason. I'm gonna check out the other ones. Let's see. switch out this one because he uh, seems to keep dying all the time not having it no wait it's damage protection uh. oh wait that's what he was using let's see I can't use that because it's for Krogan's or whatever sniper rifle why does my sniper rifle have so little accuracy. I don't know. The assault rifle has what? One accuracy rating? So 35 and 41 is actually quite good. Okay. Did realize that. Ooh. Omni gel. Is that currency? Or I don't know. Well, I changed out what I wanted, so let's do this, and I'm gonna see... Hmm. It's resources, so it's something, I guess. But I don't know if I want to turn it into... We don't have enough time! We have to get to the... Yeah, we're gonna lose her in... That time. I'm on it. Oh Watch wow! The what the fuck just happened? What? You know 
there would be Caden! He dead. God, he can't handle a single thing. Come on! I don't have time for this. She's gonna die. I'm on it! Look! Incoming! We have to be done with this soon. I've lost shields. Fatigued as well. We need to go. Open this door. I have to override it, right? No. Did you bring it? Where's the shadow broker? Where's Fist? They'll be here. Where's the evidence? No way. The deal's off. Wow. The deal's off. Hello. Caden. See, he's br blocked or whatever. <laughs> what? Which weapon overheated? Oh my god, I'm gonna try using a sniper. <laughs> what? Oh, I get it. Everything is blocked because of something, something. Just set me up. I knew I couldn't trust him. Don't worry about Fist. He got what was coming to him. Then I guess there are two things I need to thank you for. Who are you? My name's Shepard. I'm looking for evidence to prove Saren's a traitor. Then I have a chance to repay you for saving my life. But not here. We need to go somewhere safe. The ambassador's office. It's safe there. You'll want to see this anyway. You're not making my life easy, Shepard. Firefights in the wards, an all-out assault on Korra's den. Do you know how many... Who's this? A Quarian? What A are you up Quarian? to, Shepard? She can help us. Making your day, Ambassador. She has information linking Saren to the Geth. Really? Maybe you better start at the beginning, miss. My name is Tali. Tali Zora Naraya. We don't see many Quarians here. Why did you leave the flotilla? I was on my pilgrimage. My rite of passage into adulthood. Pilgrimage? I've never heard of this before. It is a tradition among my people. When we reach maturity, we leave the ships of our parents and our people behind. Alone, we search the stars, only returning to the flotilla once we have discovered something of value. 
In this way, we prove ourselves worthy of adulthood. Tell us what you found. During my travels, I began hearing reports of Geth. Since they drove my people into exile, the Geth have never ventured beyond the Veil. I was curious. I tracked a patrol of Geth to an uncharted world. I waited for one to become separated from its unit. Then I disabled it and removed its memory core. Hmm. I thought the Geth fried their memory cores when they died. Some kind of defense mechanism. Hmm. How did you manage to preserve the memory core? My people created the Geth. If you're quick, careful, and lucky, small caches of data can sometimes be saved. Most of the core was wiped clean. But I salvaged something from its audio banks. Eden Prime was a major victory. The beacon has brought us one step closer to finding the conduit. That's Saren's voice. This proves he was involved in the attack. He said Eden Prime brought him one step closer to finding the conduit. Any idea what that means? The conduit must have something to do with the beacon. Maybe it's some kind of Prothean technology. Like a weapon. Hmm. Wait, there's more. Saren wasn't working alone. Eden Prime was a major victory. The beacon has brought us one step closer to finding the conduit. And one step closer to the return of the Reapers. I don't the, recognize the that other matriarch. voice, the one talking about Reapers. Hmm. Are they some kind of new alien species? According to the memory core, the Reapers were a hyper-advanced machine race that existed 50,000 years ago. The Reapers hunted the Protheans to total extinction, and then they vanished. At least, that's what the Geth believe. Sounds a little far-fetched. The vision on Eden Prime. I understand it now. I saw the Protheans being wiped out by the Reapers. The Geth revere the Reapers as gods, the pinnacle of non-organic life. And they believe Saren knows how to bring the Reapers back. The Council is just going to love this. The Reapers are a threat to every species in Citadel space. We have to tell them. No matter what they think about the rest of this, those audiophiles prove Saren's a traitor. The Captain's right. We need to present this to the Council right away. What about her? The Quarian? My name is Tali. You saw me in the alley, Commander. You know what I can do. Let me come with you. I'll take all the help I can get. Thanks. You won't regret this. Anderson and I will go ahead to get things ready with the Council. Take a few minutes to collect yourself, then meet us in the tower. Wait, is this what I'm bringing to the... Oh. To the tower. I'm bringing her, of course, since she is a uh, direct... Uh, She's the direct witness. I can only bring two. Mm -hmm. I think these are more valuable in this sort of diplomatic sense. Computer console. Hmm. I don't know why I'm doing this, but whoops. Captain Hendrickson reported some unusual energy readings during a patrol of the Argos Row Cluster. She had particular concerns about the Hydro system, but was recalled before her team could investigate further. No patrols are scheduled for that sector. Do we want to send in a recon team? Okay. That's strange. I don't know why I looked into that, but that was kind of interesting. It's a good thing that I get to uh, get to practice my override. Excuse me, Commander Shepard. Could you spare a moment of your time? Nope. I don't have time for you. I have to talk to Citadel Tower. 
Let's do the fast travel thingy. Let's see what the council has to say about this. We will see what the council has to say about this. Come on. Udin is presenting the Quarian's evidence to the council. Oof. Eden Prime was a major victory. The beacon has brought us one step closer to finding the conduit. And one step closer to the return of the Reapers. You wanted proof? There it is. This evidence is irrefutable, Ambassador. Saren will be stripped of his Spectre status, and all efforts will be made to bring him in to answer for his crimes. I recognize the other voice, the one speaking with Saren. Matriarch Benezia. Who's she? Matriarchs are powerful Asari who have entered the final stage of their lives. Hmm. Revered for their wisdom and experience. Asari. They serve as guides and mentors to my people. Matriarch Benezia is a powerful biotic and she had many followers. She will make a formidable ally for Saren. I'm more interested in the Reapers. What do you know about them? Only what was extracted from the Geth's memory core. The Reapers were an ancient race of machines that wiped out the Prothors. Then they vanished. Hmm. The Geth believe the Reapers are gods, and Saren is the prophet for their return. We think the Conduit is the key to bringing them back. Saren's searching for it. That's why he attacked Eden Prime. Do we even know what this Conduit is? Nothing Saren else. thinks he can bring back the Reapers. That's bad enough. Listen to what you're saying. Saren wants to bring back the machines that wiped out all life in the galaxy? Impossible. It has to be. Where did the Reapers go? Why did they vanish? How come we found no trace of their existence? Hmm. If they were real, we'd have found something. Well... I tried to warn you about Saren, and you refused to face the truth. Don't make the same mistake again. This is different. You proved Saren betrayed the Council. We all agree he's using the Geth to search for the Conduit, but we don't really know why. The Reapers are obviously just a myth, Commander. A convenient lie to cover Saren's true purpose. A legend he is using to bend the Geth to his will. Fifty thousand years ago, the Reapers wiped out all galactic civilizations. If Saren finds the Conduit, it will happen again. Saren is a rogue agent on the run for his life. He no longer has the rights or resources of a Spectre. The Council has stripped him of his position. That is not good enough. You know he's hiding somewhere in the Traverse. Send your fleet in! A fleet cannot track down one man. A Citadel fleet could secure the entire region, keep the Geth from attacking any more of our colonies. Or it could trigger a war with the Terminus systems. We won't be dragged into a galactic confrontation over a few dozen human colonies. What? I can take Saren down. The commander's right. There is a way to stop Saren that doesn't require fleets or armies. No. It's too soon. Humanity is not ready for the responsibilities that come with joining the Spectres. It was a Turian Spectre who betrayed this council, and it was a human who exposed him. I've earned this. Yeah, that is so true. Bitch. Am I going to be a Spectre now? Commander Shepard, step forward. Woo! It's happening! It's happening! Yes! I'm getting status! Woo! It is the decision of the Council that you be granted all the powers and privileges of the Special Tactics and Reconnaissance Branch of the Citadel. Spectres are not trained, but chosen. Individuals forged in the fire of service and battle. Those whose actions elevate them above the rank and file. Spectres are an ideal, a symbol, the embodiment of courage, determination self-reliance. They are the right hand of the Council, instruments of our will. Spectres bear a great burden. They are protectors of galactic peace, 
both our first and last line of defense. The safety of the galaxy is theirs to uphold. I will guard the galaxy. You are the first human Spectre, Commander. This is a great accomplishment for you and your entire species. I am not the first human Spectre, though. My captain was, but okay. I'm honored, Counselor. We're sending you into the Traverse after Saren. He's a fugitive from justice, so you are authorized to use any means necessary to apprehend or eliminate him. Any idea where to find him? We will forward any relevant files to Ambassador Udina. This meeting of the Council is adjourned. Congratulations, Commander. We've got a lot of work to do, Shepard. You're going to need a ship, a crew, supplies. You'll get access to special equipment and training now. You should go down to the CSEC Academy and speak to the Spectre Requisitions Officer. Anderson, come with me. I'll need your help to set all this up. I thought the Ambassador would be a little more grateful. He didn't even thank you. Eh. He's got a lot on his mind. Come on. Right behind you, Shepard. Yes! So, this means I'm ending my stream. Not this in of itself, but I am ending the stream now. So, uh, yeah. Um, thanks for watching. Thanks for chatting. And, uh, let's see. I'll be streaming again tomorrow. I don't, f I don't remember what time, but I will be streaming again tomorrow. So, uh, yeah. I think I'll be streaming Dead by Daylight tomorrow. Uh, that's gonna be fun. Hey. Yep. So this is it. Happy gaming. Bye.